Hi Aquarius, welcome to my channel for doing your reading. Relax, it's just the reading. <laughs> that's the intro now of this channel. Sorry about this, that's irritating me. You guys will not be irritated, but I am. Uh -huh. There's no monitor yet here, because we have a heavy production right now going on in car. A lot of things going on, Aqua. So let's, uh, let's get, we're gonna start first with Oracle and then we go for the tarot. Uh -huh. So we'll see. And then the intuitive also. Wow, you're getting a lot over here. Mm -hmm. You're getting a lot except the person that you want. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm messing with the Aquas. Okay, so let's see here. Okay. Oh, which no, I did invite my best friend who's an Aquarius. Uh -huh. Okay. But he far. He far. He left me here. <laughs> He's all over to me. He's gonna be with me in spirit. Okay. So let's see what's going on first with you guys. Let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on. Why? Ooh! Co create. Building something with someone, definitely. A leopard, an owl, and an egg. Yeah, that's a typical kind of a day of an Aquarian. Okay. Because chances are you're involved in so many things with different things, but it makes sense for you. For you, this makes sense. Seeing a leopard, an owl, and an egg. Uh huh. But for others, like, so what is that? For you, it's just like, that's my day. And that's also my relationship. And that's my life in the egg. Because uh -huh. the cheetah over there, I feel like that's your day running around. The soulmate, the cuckoo, hoo, 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 the owl over there, is the connection. You're looking at it, but you're too busy. The egg is you, your life itself. Because for you, I remember. Uh -huh. No, I was, uh, yeah, I was talking to a, yeah, it's interesting, okay. Because um, I was talking to an Aquarian, and I sent an oracle um, like this also, but it was the peace one. So you could be, chances are, um, uh, having a new beginning and also settling. You could be settling down, okay. So that's why you're busy. And you're just looking at the relationship right now, or the connections. It's like, well, if it happens, it happens. But right now, this is where I'm at. This is where my mind is. So you're very focused. You could be collaborating with other people, co-create. You have a project. There's a team. You're learning to become a team player, which you are, though. So either the person now is learning to be a team player with you. Because there's always has something to you know connected with the player. The team... Co, <laughs> or whatever. I guess it's just gonna be a bad news, yes? <laughs> so let's see, number 40. That's good. Ooh, what is this? Empress. Okay. Empress is the equivalent of a Wheel of Fortune, but on a feminine energy. Okay, abundant, feeling good. Everything is taken care of when the Empress comes in. It's a vibe, okay? Like she slay. She slay by not doing anything, by not even, um, how to say this, uh, like she doesn't make much effort, okay, and things are getting done. Um, because, how do you express this with, because the abundance comes natural for the Empress because of, they are the receiver of the energy, okay. Um, people will serve her, I mean, you know, will come to her because she cares also. The only thing that she gives is caring and loving unconditional because the Empress will do that mm -hmm. because she has a lot of love. Okay. This is what's inside your head, I feel. This is what's inside your head. This is Taurus or Libra. This is Venus. You feeling good also here. It can be feeling successful with your finances. Someone wants to talk to you. Someone can be spiteful of your success. Just give you a heads up. Like you're doing well. And then there's someone who's just like, why are you doing well? I mean, well, why do you mind me? Okay. Get a life, Knight of Swords. Because <laughs> someone is not accepting of what you're building. Mm -hmm. I don't know who that is, but the Knight of Swords is mean. They nasty. Mm -hmm. I feel like ever since like you don't put much effort, they're, they're having that energy right now. Oh, yes. There you go. You gotta try it. So they don't like that they have to be the one working on the relationship, but the empress does not work. It's a freaking empress. Okay. <laughs> not as well as with a chair. It's just like they're coming in rushing towards you the moment that you 
sit down and don't do anything. You were the team player before, but chances are you got played. Mm -hmm. And now you're just gonna be like, I ain't moving over here. I'm a freaking empress. I sit down. You wanna come to me? Come at me, bro. Come at me. Knight of Swords with a chart. Come at me. I want you to come at me. No, no pun intended. Come at me. C O M E. Okay. If it's the accent. <laughs> Dear Lord. Oh. You have the moon card and the chariot here. It shows that this person having the chariot and the moon, okay, their only focus is to see you, to meet you, to be with you. The I, the, you know, the, their whole I, meaning the, the self, is about you because this is the mind, okay? That's the moon. Also, their emotion and feelings. Now, the chariot also here shows that they, okay, um, they haven't been honest as much as their feelings, okay? They're going to come express it. That's the night. This is one of those accidentally texting you or messaging you for no reason. And then it's like, what? And it's just like, I know you have that feelings for me. It's just like, blah, 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 blah. They're upset. They're mad. They're mad. Mm. You slaying. Page of Pentacles. This is what you're going to message this person. I'm sorry. What do you mean? You know, page. <laughs> you downplay. Okay. Two of Wands makes them think. Are you seeing someone else? Because they have this, you know, the Snoop Dogg card also. They have the globe over there. They're watching you. They're watching you if you're talking to someone. They're nowhere what you're doing. Two of ones. Oh, don't underestimate the power of stalking at this time. Because mm -hmm. Tarot is talking. The Queen of Cups. Who is this Cancerian that's obsessed with you now? They're all watery here. Okay, Pisces also. Queen of Swords. Oh, <laughs> You've cut off someone, you let them be because they, they cannot make up their mind, okay? That woke them, <laughs> not made up their mind. Because two queens over here and they're not facing each other. So I feel like you've totally divided. It's like, it can be same sex, okay? It's never about the genitalia, okay? It can be any kind of connection. Love is for everyone. No color, no race, no gender, no nationality. Love is for everyone. Mm -hmm. That's the only thing that is so pure okay, that you cannot define it. Mm -hmm. But you defined it. B I T Z H, get off of me, Queen of Swords. You're that energy. Yeah. <laughs> I know what is love, and you are not expressing it. Ten of Wands, and you felt so burdened. Ooh, no. Okay. Knight of Pentacles, and you pull back the energy, you stop, and you don't talk about Pentacles. And you felt like this is what you deserve. They don't like it that you stand up for who you are and what you are right now. People don't like that. <laughs> People don't like when they're doing themselves. Mm -hmm. Because it makes them feel inadequate. Okay, This person is not jealous of you. But in general, in essence, I'm just explaining why people, why you get haters or why you get other people, um, you know, not vibing with you when you're on your way up. Because they cannot understand how can someone do, okay, uh, how to say this, things this way. You know, it's like, as an acquire myself, mm -hmm. you get it. Like, people don't, uh, when, when people don't understand that you're just being you and genuine you and you're making it like an empress, it's injustice for them. You know, that's their karma, to see that side. So this person's karma, and I say karma, it's not about the good or bad, it's about life. Now they see their life as someone's like, oh, okay. They had the reality check. You did a queen of swords, you pull the plug, you say, like, okay, well, I'm gonna go Cersei of queen of, uh, queen of thrones, game of thrones. It's really queen because they're all ladies over there. It's never Jon Snow. Okay, it's Queen of Thrones, not Game of Thrones. Okay, so you know it was the Empress ruling the whole time there, right? Um, I forgot. There's Cersei and the other girl. Okay, uh, I call it the other girl. Okay, <laughs> Five of Pentacles. Okay, we will suffer here, but that's what it's meant for. Okay, it's good. You, I cut you off. I know I will feel it. You know, but because it's like. Regardless, we feel five of pentacles. We can be talking to each other and seeing each other, but we're five of pentacles with each other. Pull the plug. You did it. You couldn't take it anymore. You stop. And this is now 
their momentum. It ain't fun being woke by an aqua. Because you they're coming to you. They're coming. With sound effects. Okay. So I'll continue this reading aqua. Link down there in the description box. We'll get more sound effects if we have budget. Okay. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Okay. <laughs> what is that? I don't know. I need lunch. Okay. Uh, so but you pull the plug. You're claiming justice and victory here. We'll see how it is coming, because this person is. No pun intended again. I'll see you guys again, Aqua. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye.